conflict, uh, and if not, was there any communication between the Syrian government and the American government concerning this incident? Uh, it, it, we're heartened by the, the uh, uh, very low level of any violent activity here for the last several days. Um, I, I'm not saying there'll be no exceptions amongst the NLA uh, that, would, that would perhaps hamper the process, um, but, uh, but we're going into this, so I think, for the right reasons. And, and the, the, from all appearances, both the NLA and the government of, of Macedonia uh, seem to be uh, going in for the right reasons as well. And what guarantees are these that you... And we'll have a uh, written version of that statement. Do you, do you know put when, when, he, when exactly he was indicted? Um, I don't know if I have a, a detail of his in. We also welcome President Tchaikovsky's announcement of a demobilization plan, which includes a reintegration component. These are important elements of the peace process. Uh, so that the people of Macedonia, of all ethnicities, the citizens of Macedonia can uh, put the conflict behind them and move forward uh, in a spirit of reconciliation uh, for the betterment of uh, their e economic and social situation and uh, a better life for, for all citizens of the country in, in the future. So obviously a lot of work remains to be done. We've said, as the G8 said, that uh, some kind of monitoring function uh, could be useful, but it needs to be something that's uh, approved by both parties. Um, in terms of Mr. Albaz, I'm not going to uh, try to address all of his uh, uh, comments in the press at this point. As you know, he's meeting tomorrow with Secretary Powell, so we'll wait to let that meeting uh, take place. So, do you have any comment on that? Well, I've seen a variety of